Imagine a universe that isn't ours, yet feels strangely familiar. A vast expanse of galaxies, stars, and planets, all obeying the same physical laws we know so well. For eons, it stretches outward, carried by the relentless expansion of space itself, galaxies drifting ever farther apart. But in this realm, the cosmic balance begins to falter. The forces that once drove its growth waver, and gravity quietly starts to assert itself. The outward rush slows, falters, and finally reverses. Space contracts, drawing everything inexorably inward. As the universe teeters on the edge of a singularity, a point where time and space might vanish, something extraordinary occurs. Quantum forces, extreme and unpredictable, push back against gravity's crushing pull. The collapse stops. It rebounds. It bursts outward, giving rise to a new cosmos. From that violent yet miraculous rebound, our own universe emerges. Here, the Big Bang is not the ultimate beginning. According to the standard model of cosmology, 13.8 billion years ago, our universe erupted from an intensely hot, dense state. Over time, the interplay of gravity and fundamental physics sculpted the galaxies, stars, and cosmic webs we observe today. This framework, reinforced by Einstein's general relativity, illuminates much of what we see. The faint hum of the cosmic microwave background, the intricate lattice of galaxies stretching across the void, and the accelerating expansion driven by the enigmatic force we call dark energy. Yet profound mysteries remain. We still cannot fully grasp the true essence of dark matter and dark energy, though together they account for nearly 95% of all cosmic content. But what if the answer were simpler than we imagine? Could the universe's birth be explained purely through known physical laws, without invoking hypothetical forces or particles? A team at the University of Portsmouth has suggested a daring alternative. Perhaps our universe was born inside a colossal black hole, nested within a vast parent universe. Their inquiry began with a simple, audacious question. What if the formation of a universe mirrors the collapse of a massive star into a black hole? To test this, they ran detailed simulations, searching for a model that could resolve lingering inconsistencies in cosmology. And to their astonishment, the solution wasn't speculative. It already existed, a precise analytical description of the very process they sought to understand. In the strange realm of quantum mechanics, identical particles like electrons or neutrons cannot share the exact same state at the same time. This is Pauli's exclusion principle in action. When you try to cram too many of these particles into a tiny space, nature resists. That resistance is called degeneracy pressure. The more relentlessly gravity pushes to squeeze matter together, the stronger the pushback becomes. It's this force that stops white dwarfs and neutron stars from collapsing endlessly, and in some cases, can trigger spectacular supernova explosions. In the Portsmouth team's model, the same principle governs a collapsing universe. As the cosmos contracts to extreme densities, degeneracy pressure builds until it can finally counter gravity, halting the collapse before a singularity forms. The universe then rebounds, a cosmic bounce that launches a new era of expansion. For any observers inside, this bounce would look indistinguishable from a traditional Big Bang. You might point out that bouncing universe theories aren't new. What sets this one apart is that it relies entirely on well-established physics, without invoking exotic particles or mysterious forces. It's a purely gravitational collapse happening within a black hole. While we understand degeneracy pressure in stars, we've never directly seen matter at the extreme densities reached inside black holes. Yet rather than assuming collapse must end in a singularity, where physics breaks down, the team suggests quantum effects could naturally prevent such infinities. And here's where it gets really exciting. Their model predicts that ancient relics, primordial black holes or neutron stars that survived the bounce, 
could still exist in our universe. Discovering them, especially in the early cosmos, would strongly support this bold idea. Already, the Webb telescope has found unexpectedly massive ancient galaxies shortly after the Big Bang, difficult to explain under the standard model, but easier if early black holes jump-started their formation. It's a radical perspective, yet the authors argue that questioning long-held assumptions is essential to progress. Interestingly, new Webb telescope observations of galaxy rotations might be pointing in the same direction, that our universe itself could reside within a black hole. A recent study uncovered a surprising pattern. Most galaxies appear to rotate in the same direction. By examining the curves of their spiral arms, researchers can determine their spin. In a truly random universe, rotations should be roughly evenly split. But this unexpected alignment contradicts standard cosmology, hinting that our universe may indeed be inside a black hole. To make sense of this, we need to explore the physics of black holes themselves. When matter collapses under gravity to form a black hole, it creates a boundary known as the event horizon, a point of no return beyond which not even light can escape. Anything that crosses it vanishes from the perspective of an outside observer. But what truly happens inside remains one of physics's greatest mysteries. This is where black hole cosmology, or Schwarzschild cosmology, enters the picture. It proposes a radical idea. Our observable universe might be the interior of a black hole residing in an even larger parent universe. Think about the Big Bang in this context. Traditionally, the universe is said to have begun as a singularity, a point of infinite density, remarkably similar to the center of a black hole. If our universe exists inside such a black hole, the Big Bang wasn't an explosion into empty space, it was the moment matter collapsed into a black hole, giving birth to a new universe within. This also opens a tantalizing possibility. Every black hole in our universe could be a doorway to another baby universe. It might even explain why the fundamental constants of nature seem perfectly tuned for life. Perhaps black holes that form stable universes are more likely to endure and reproduce in this cosmic lineage. The researchers believe this perspective could clarify several cosmic puzzles. Black holes carry enormous entropy, hinting at the vast amount of information contained within our universe. Another intriguing factor is torsion. In extended forms of general relativity, such as Einstein-Cartan theory, torsion represents a twisting of space-time caused by the intrinsic spin of particles. Some theories suggest that at extreme densities, torsion could produce a repulsive force, preventing singularities from forming. In this scenario, instead of collapsing to an infinitely small point, a black hole might bounce, with its core rebounding outward to create a new universe. The team suggests that this rebound, the big bounce, could be what we perceive as the Big Bang. Rather than a singularity exploding from nothing, our universe might have been reborn from the heart of a black hole in a parent cosmos. This radically shifts our understanding, portraying the creation of universes as an ongoing, self-replicating cycle. Even more fascinating, the universe may have a preferred axis. Observations of large-scale cosmic structures reveal subtle alignments in galaxy distributions and motions, hinting at a cosmic anisotropy. If confirmed, this challenges the long-held assumption that the universe is uniform and directionless on the largest scales. Such a preferred direction could point to unknown physics, possibly linked to our universe's formation inside a black hole, or the behavior of fundamental forces at cosmic scales. The presence of massive ancient galaxies soon after the Big Bang further complicates the picture, challenging standard models of cosmic evolution. Of course, there could be simpler explanations. Some measurements, such as the Milky Way's rotational speed, may need revisiting. Yet these anomalies underscore one thing. The universe is far stranger than we ever imagined, and its unexpected patterns may force astrophysicists to rethink core assumptions. What do you think about these possibilities? Drop your thoughts in the comments below. And remember to subscribe to Cosmos Origins. This is your space to explore the cosmos.